Happy Friday guys, welcome to a weekend in my life living in Dallas, Texas. I'm actually vlogging this weekend because I am not going out. I am tired, I have so much going on, and I leave again on Monday, not going out. This is an incredibly rare occurrence, so I figured I might as well film a little vlog, a little weekend in my life, if you will. If you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe. Here's my outfit, I'm also dressed like a mom. I'm currently drinking an energy drink, which I have been trying to not drink recently, but like, here I am. For a 5.45 dinner reservation, we've never had a res this early, but we just had to to get into this restaurant. My jeans are Abercrombie, I'm sure you guys are all shocked. My shoes are Revolve, they're currently sold out, but they're going to be like my new summer shoe. Like, look at how cute they are. Sweater is also Revolve. Necklace is golden. It's a cute little like K locket. I put very minimal effort into actually getting up ready. And here we are. I'm off. We're going to get sushi. I'm coming straight home. I just want to be cozy, like watch a movie, read a book. I've also got a pack this weekend. Leave for national on Monday. I'm there recording for the week. So I really need to get all those episodes prepped because I am way further behind than I normally am. Need to pack, laundry. I, we've got some things to do. Okay, I'm going to work out this weekend, which I never do. I've turned a new leaf. Maybe this is Tom Kenzie making a comeback. Probably not. Currently listening to Taylor Swift, just packing my bag for the night. I have my mask, my aquaphor for my sunburned lips, and then my vitamins. So love that for me. Um, I am really old now, so. I'm about to call my Uber. I'm really excited. Oh God, we've wanted to go to this place for so long. So I hope it's good. All right. Good morning guys, happy Saturday. I slept in, I skipped my workout class. And honestly, fine, I'm tired. I think I need to have like a really chill weekend. But I will say like I, my body is feeling the door dashing all the time and the inconsistent workouts. I just feel emotionally, mentally, obviously physically, but that's not even really what I care the most about. I mean, I should, but it's so much better when I'm in my routine. So when I get back from Nashville, we're gonna have a whole week in my life vlog of getting back on track, of getting back into going on like my daily, like long walks of like healthy stuff, but that's not really happening this weekend. I'm currently doing the Finish CBD face mask. I just door dash breakfast. Um, in a few hours, Jess and I are gonna get our nails done. I got home last night at 10. We did actually drink a lot more than I was expecting. Well, here we go. Here's the next one. It actually is convenient that it's split into two. I've been back on my sheet mask game this week. Oh, wow. I just ordered an iced vanilla latte. I started watching Bad Vegan last night on Netflix when I got home at 10. Um, and it was actually really interesting. So I think I'm gonna watch that. And then in a few hours, I'm getting my nails done, going to Sephora. Maybe I'll do laundry this afternoon. Maybe I'll cook, who knows? I kind of do feel like cooking a meal tonight. I leave on Monday. Maybe I will finally go grocery shopping. There is no more. I was home for like a week. I should have grocery shopped. Like there was no reason. I was just busy and I not. I could have. I could have Instacarted. Okay. I could have done some things. And I need to take care of myself better and focus on health because health is wealth, baby. And I just feel so much better when I'm taking care of myself. Obviously, but happy Saturday. A nice chill, cozy weekend. You know, wearing my Skims, of course. My breadwinning housewife crew available. Linked below. Um, I have them in every size, so I can't tell you which size I wear because I wear everyone. So uh, it just depends on how. How oversized you want them. I don't know why Fitz is sitting like that. Like he has so much room and he's just sitting like that. So I don't know what's up with that. This is what I got for breakfast from Company Cafe. It looks absolutely incredible. I've never gone there before, but I just saw it online. I mean, oh my God, so good. I mean like truly what a morning, right guys? How am I already on episode three? Did I fall asleep? Off to get my nails done. They're looking rough. Yeah, enjoy for the weekend. All right, I got my nails done. I just got bubble bath. I never have them short anymore. It feels so odd, but this is just what I needed right now. Now, walking into my favorite Sephora at West Village. It's so cute. You can't film in here, but it's beautiful. All right, first off, my outfit is incredible. Second off, just got a ton of stuff at Sephora. I'll do a haul later. We're gonna go get some food. We're at Honest Taco, which is now where Taco Diner used to be in West Village. And everything's so granite. They have like gluten-free dairy, everything, right? It looks so good. 
All right, I have a little grocery haul, even though I am leaving in two days. I finally cracked. I have kale, Italian sausage, tortellini, onions, avocado. I just got like two little oat milk nitro cold brew coffees, so I didn't have to get a whole thing. Smart sweets, I always put these on the list, and most of the time they're out of stock, so I got three. Tomato paste, crushed tomatoes, again, for the recipe. Oh, this just came in PR. I have the Whey scalp and body scrub. I love the Whey products, I'm obsessed. Heavy cream, um, almond milk, because I have so many Magic Spoon cereal boxes that I just like need to try more of them. They're so good. And then chicken stock. So that is my grocery haul. All right, y'all, I just took like the shower, the whole shebang. I feel incredible. I'm in pajamas and it is currently 6 p.m. Um, but I just am loving my life. I'm wearing daily drills, um, but I'm gonna do my Sephora haul now because I brought it upstairs. First thing I got is the Sephora 80. Also, my face is like tingling. I don't, I don't know what's going on with that, but I got the Sephora 80 bronzer brush because I needed a new one. I also got the Flower Wolf. This stuff is always probably such a scam because you barely get anything and they upcharge you so much but i did get the flower bomb perfume for travel just because i am traveling next week and i needed a travel shampoo anyways bringing it back to the nars laguna bronzer i have not had one of these in forever i wanted to get the duo with the like orgasm blush but they were out okay it's really hard having short nails doing things now because like i can't get anything done packaging is so nice and it's this bronzer as we know but i just haven't used a Laguna bronzer in years. Pillow Talk lip liner, Pillow Talk lipstick. Again, I'll link this all below. A lot of these are refills of just things that I needed. Oh, I also got, if you guys watched the combo vlogs and you saw Margo show me the TikTok trend with the um, Rare Beauty blush and highlighter, you do two dots of the blush and then three of the highlighter in the area that you would put highlighter on blend it out and it's like the most amazing thing maybe i'll actually do it in the morning i probably wasn't gonna wear makeup but now i just might i also got a dior lip glow it was the last one just the lip glow oil clear such a good basic to have and then i also got the lip like maximizer because i love bright pink lipstick or lip gloss like i'm not gonna put it on right now but i just love it especially when i like tan and with blonde hair it's just really like one of my go-to beauty things and then i got a bite beauty agave intensive lip mask i love bite beauty lip products so i'm actually going to use that right this second oh no everything is going into my sink that is not good i'm going to start making dinner soon i'm um, hopefully going to read tonight and this one has like a little bit of color to it as well just like tinted good to have keep away from your dogs because for whatever reason dogs love to bite these but i love it so that's my sephora haul i think i'm gonna go start on dinner you know i'm feeling feeling really put together this saturday actually no i'm not i randomly am always in a weird mood on saturdays i don't know what it is it might be like the lack of structure i'm not sure or so i don't know what that is also i've been loving the lux unfiltered conditioning body cream i've always used this but i especially use it when i have a fake tan on like right now um i'm out of it so i didn't use it today i actually also love let me show you this one oh yeah this is one the way body cream Oh my god, they're a podcast sponsor, and I have used so much of it, I've gone through like two. The Kapari, like hyaluronic acid one, is also incredible. I just, I'm really into body products, especially because I feel like my legs will get dry really easily, and I've just been really on top of that lately. So I'll link below everything that I just talked about, but I think it's time to start on dinner. <laughs> All right, I just ate dinner. I started rewatching Nashville, one of my favorite shows ever. I have my books, my journals, my journaling cards, smart sweets, some recess in a wine glass, and it is not even 8 p.m. Just gonna relax for the rest of the night. Here's my pajama set. I will talk to you guys in the morning. It's just so cozy and clean, and it feels so good.
Happy Sunday, guys. I've gone on a walk. I've been doing laundry all morning. I'm about to get an IV. Um, reset IV is coming to my house. This is much needed. My energy levels have been so down. This typically happens like right before my cycle anyways, which it feels a little bit early to be doing that. Could be the traveling, could be, I don't, really don't know what it is. So, I'm getting an IV. Um, I listened to the Skinny Confidential Health and Wellness like routines and stuff today, which really just like made me want to get back on my wellness stuff i want a sauna like an infrared sauna from higher dose in my house so bad there's room in my garage i keep considering it anyways i'm in the middle of doing laundry i'm gonna go clean up my closet my girl from reset iv just texted me that she's almost here and i hope that my closet will only take like five minutes we're having a productive sunday have to pack have to plan outfits have to episode prep i have spin at 4 30 you know just a little sunday reset if you will all right i broke my vlog camera so i'm gonna have to buy a new one of those today um so we're on my camera or my phone i got an id you can't see i have my band-aid under there um all the info is going to be on my instagram but reset iv is now in texas they're really good for like a hangover iv not hungover i just wanted like beauty and energy because my skin has been acting up and I've been so exhausted, which is probably why my skin is acting up. So all the info, I'm gonna like save it to a highlight or something. I already feel better and I don't know if that's just like placebo. I've gotten um, IVs in the past when I lived in Los Angeles because obviously you can take the girl out of LA but you can't take the LA out of the girl, you know what I mean? Um, but yeah, anyways, hopefully that really helps me just cause I've been so run down and I am gonna work out today, which always helps. Um, last, I don't know if I even mentioned this, I started rewatching Nashville, which is my favorite TV show, and I was like, I should really just do it since I'm going tomorrow. I'm gonna heat up some lunch, um, and then get back to packing. I actually have a good amount already done, so I'm feeling good about that. This is what I have so far for packing. Not everything, that's what I'm gonna wear tomorrow, I think. I don't have too much left, so I guess that's a good thing. Hello, Coco. Aww. Do you wanna come? Do you wanna go to Nashville? Do you wanna go? <laughs> I don't know what it is. Something about someone seeing you on a dating app is right? so vulnerable. Like, I should never see you <laughs> like that. so true. No. <laughs> and it's so funny because it's like we're all on the apps, but we're all so embarrassed to be on the yes. apps also. I don't get it. Yes. 